Welcome to the test of a diaper that has surprised me like no other for a long time. And not just in one thing. It already starts with the package. It's pretty discreet as you can see, no colorful illustrations or anything like that. It's a neutral white plastic package that you would expect to see on a medical diaper. But we are talking about little for big here, as can be seen from the logo on the package and the web address to the homepage. If you open the package, a snow white diaper comes to light. It has a somewhat glittery adhesive surface on the front, as it is sealed with reusable plastic adhesives. Already here I noticed that it is a rather thicker diaper, not to be compared with the other, significantly thinner little for big, which I had already tried in other videos, that is the second surprise. The outer material has also changed, it is also made of plastic film, but it is significantly thicker and pleasantly soft. The adhesives seem a bit small considering this thick diaper, which doesn't turn out to be a problem in the practical test. Inside, it has high leakage cuffs, which is good for protecting against leaks. In addition, there is thus still room to equip the diaper with absorbent pads, this can further improve the suction performance. From the outside, the thick and soft film is somewhat reminiscent of the long gone days when it was normal for every diaper to have a film on the outside. Plastic is widely used in the ABDL scene, but it is rare to find such a soft film. I find them very comfortable in terms of feel. Stronger than suspected are the small acting adhesives, they hold the diaper very well, which you notice when you try to loosen it, for example. You have to pull a little harder than with the other little for big, which promises a good hold. In the practical test, the diaper proved to be very thirsty, even when it was already noticeably full and I noticed how the liquid was still distributed in the diaper when I sat down, nothing leaked. The high leakage protection has obviously done the best job here, it prevents leakage, so that everything can be well distributed inside. It weighed more than 2.2 kilograms before the first drops ran out of the diaper. Once I had to spontaneously leave the house and therefore change her well before the leakage. There whoa, she weighed more than 1.8 kilograms. 2.0 kilograms are therefore certainly possible without problems when sitting down. In standing as with any diaper again significantly more. 230 grams weighs an empty diaper. It makes clear that it is a thicker diaper with comparatively much material. The diaper is available, but unfortunately currently only at a store that delivers to Germany. At least I'm not aware of any others where you can order them directly without importing. Depending on where you live, that may be different. One package costs 31.79 euros and contains 10 diapers, which makes a price of about 3.18 euros each. So compared to other diapers, we are currently at the beginning of the upper price range here. Already one AB dry is clearly noticeable between the legs. I have test times two pulled over each other, so a double diaper package. I had done that a long time ago, but with two diapers, which are much thinner and less endure in comparison. If you pull two AB dry on top of each other which are also already filled, it is difficult to close the legs, so you definitely have one of the thickest diaper packs currently available. For everyday life, of course, this is nothing and for most of you probably not necessary. Already an AB dry can withstand extremely much and is thus one of the strongest diapers currently on the market. Only a few even manage to crack the 2 kilo mark. This one not only just barely made it, but is a good bit over that mark. To illustrate this in everyday use, I put the diaper on in the morning during a test run and drank several 0.7 liter bottles of water throughout the day, which is a relatively large amount of liquid. Despite this, it did not start leaking until around 4 pm in the afternoon. Very impressive how much this diaper can withstand. Towards the end, I thought it would never leak. After all, I always sit down to test if it leaks then. With this one, you could see and feel how much it was already filled. When sitting down, the liquid was literally pushed around in the diaper. This is normally the point at which many diapers have to give up because they can no longer absorb it. With this one, nothing happened at all. I was able to make another larger load of urine into the diaper. Even after that, it didn't leak right away. It took a bit and even when it started leaking, it wasn't a larger amount, just a few drops. Of course, you can still feel and see it on the pants if you look closely. Therefore, the same conditions apply to all my tests. As soon as the pants get wet over the diaper, the test is over and the weight of the diaper is weighed. From little for big I already had several diapers in the test. The loyal viewers among you who have subscribed to my channel and therefore do not miss any new videos, have certainly already seen the videos on this and know. While the little for big tested so far look nice, as they are colorfully printed, the wearing comfort was also okay. But in terms of suction performance, they didn't deliver particularly good results. And at a price that, in my opinion, was not reasonable for the performance provided. 
There is a certain irony in the fact that these inferior diapers cost about the same as the AB Dry tested here. The AB Dry is far better though, the only thing it doesn't have is colorful prints. By the way, I also compared the price to just under a year ago, that is, late summer 2022, there I ordered the AB Dry at the price of 31.79 euros per pack of 10. So there was no price increase. That has to be mentioned positively nowadays, as many other diapers have become more expensive. Some within a halfway reasonable range, like crinkles. Others excessively overpriced like individual from Abu, such as the Peak Abu. With the AB Dry, the price is still okay for the performance offered. This diaper is perfect to be worn at night, or during the day when very high absorbency is desired. To that end, it is comfortable with a thick film, so you feel thick and securely wrapped. Even though it's thick, you can still wear it relatively inconspicuously when empty, unless you're pulling a very skin-tight pair of jeans over it. However, this changes of course when the diaper becomes fuller. Therefore, it is recommended for travel only limited, at least if discretion is important to you. For at home, in nature, or if you don't find others noticing your diaper, then it is a monster. The only thing you have to do without with this diaper, colorful motifs. It is one of the examples where companies that mainly produce ABDL diapers also have unprinted ones in their range. Some of you may already know this from my other videos, it's similar with North Shore for example. Abu also once released a white diaper. Who does not want to do without colorful imprints, however, has here a good chance to paint it yourself. This goes thanks to the thick film with this particularly well, even with thicker felt pens that stick there, like Eddings. I know some who have embellished their diapers with great self-painted designs. These are definitely not boring designs, but all unique. It's certainly not for everyone, but after seeing a few the other day, I wanted to throw it out there. If you'd rather have ready printed or thinner diapers, you can find another diaper video in a playlist with all my tests on the side. In the meantime I have thus this of interest sake of the research of these the That's not all. I always test new diapers and share my experiences. Sometimes I also record videos with other useful information or tips for everyone who wears or has to wear diapers. So to never miss a video again, feel free to subscribe to my channel. A subscription costs you nothing and you will be informed by YouTube when I upload a new video. That's not all. I'm always testing new diapers and sharing my experiences. Sometimes I also record videos with other useful information or tips for anyone who wears or needs to wear diapers. So to never miss a video again, feel free to subscribe to my channel. A subscription costs you nothing and you will be informed by YouTube when I upload a new video. If you like to tell me your opinion, you can also write a comment about what you think about this video or this diaper. No matter if you already tried out this one, or you just watched the video and now have a feeling if you like to try it or maybe not. 